What's up everybody? Welcome to another episode of Pokemon Joe. Today is going to be focused around the binder and we're going to start with all the cards that we pulled in the Elite Trainer Box. So, in the Elite Trainer Box we pulled a Reverse Hollow Grookey and we do have the Dex Entry Grookey so we don't have the Reverse Hollow so let's go ahead and add that to the binder. And then we have Reverse Hollow Thwacky and it is this one that we already have the Reverse Hollow to so will not be added. And uh, before we turn the page, let's just go ahead and go back one and go ahead and look at how the binder's doing. You know, it's uh, it's still a work in progress. And as you can see, we have we are missing Celebi and Whimsicott. But good news, Whimsicott is in the back of the binder. So uh, these are all just the Dollar Tree packs. Uh, these all came from just the Dollar Tree packs. So um, over here, you know, naturally we are missing. Uh, two different Rillabooms, but we do have one in the back of the binder. So if Dollar Tree ever stops selling these uh, Sword and Shield packs, then you know, we'll go ahead and get that. We don't have any uh, fire types to add to the binder right now, but let's just go ahead. And we got, you know, Orbeetle, Gossiflor, Eldegoss, Vulpix. We're missing some other cards. I'm not sure off the top of my head what they are, but Heatmore, Saladin. I, want, I know one of them is Victini V. You know, and then over here we've got... Let's see, I can do this. There we go. We've got Salazzle, Score Bunny, Score Bunny, Reboot, Reboot, Cinderace, and then this Cinderace. And we have this one in the back of the binder as well. Uh, let's see what else we have up here. Sizzlipede, Sizzlipede, Cinescorch, you know, pretty much all these. Uh, the next one is Cloyster, which we already have, so we do not need to be adding him to the binder. Um, next up we have Kingler. We need Kingler, but this did not come from a Dollar Tree pack, so I'm just going to set it to the side and we'll add that to the back of the binder. And next up we have this beautiful Lapras V card, which is number 40... 45? So it's going to go right here after Lapras. So we don't have it, so it's going to be a back of the binder find, which we might actually already have it in the back of the binder. Uh, as you can see, these are the ones we're missing. And, I don't know, there we go. We're missing those. We're missing, which is, this one might be the Lapras that we just added. Uh, we do, we are missing, I believe, an Inteleon and Dreadnought we actually have in the back of the binder. Uh, over here, this whole page is complete. Um, I want to say this is the first completed page that we've come across. Uh, and then right here, we have a uh, Yamper that looks like a regular Yamper, and we did get the... Um, Reverse Hollow out of the uh, Elite Trainer box, so there's that, and we're missing a good amount. Now this Morpico, we did get the Reverse Hollow for it in the Elite Trainer box as well, and since we already have the Dex entry, we'll go ahead and stick them in. All right, and then the next one goes right here, but it's not a Dollar Tree entry, so it's not getting added. Uh, we do have a Reverse Hollow Ponita, which. It's going to go right there, seeing how we already have the Dex Entry one. And then the Rapidash, we do not have the Dex Entry, and this would be it. But, again, not Dollar Tree. Poltegeist, we already have the Reverse Hollow for it. You can see um, we are missing just a couple of cards over here. This one and this one, but this one's in the back of the binder, and it's going to be in the back of the binder. And this one, I'm not 100% sure off the top of my head which one it is. This whole page is completely full. And we do not need Reverse Hollow Rhyperior, so that can go over there. And over here we've got another full page. And we've actually, all the, it is 100% true, all the cards you see, the V cards and the gold cards and stuff that are in this binder over on this side and not in the back, I legitimately pulled from Dollar Tree packs. All right, next up we've got Nicket. We do not have the Reverse Hollow for Nicket, but we already have the Dex entry, so we'll go ahead and pop that in there. And now that is completed, but I still haven't got a Thievul. I've never pulled a Thievul. Over here we've got Bisharp. Wait, what? Oh, I'm, sh I'm looking at Ponyard trying to figure out why it looks different. But we have the Reverse Hollow by Sharp, so this page is already completed. We're just putting in the odds and ends, so they're all Dex entries. Over here, we don't have anything to add, but we're missing quite a bit of stuff on this page right here. 
you know, including these two spots or these two spots. I want to say this is Snorlax V and this is Snorlax V Max, and I'm not 100% sure what these are off the top of my head. This one, I can't think for the life of me what it is. I don't have anything in front of me just telling me, so uh, your guess is as good as mine. Um, but over here, we do have this card should be going right there. And it's not a Dollar Tree pool, so it'll get added to the back of the binder. And ladies and gentlemen, let's just go ahead and turn the page. This page is completely full, so you can see that. And this one is completely done, and I believe this starts the, uh, the V cards. And yeah, that's, actually this might be an energy, I can't remember. But anyhow, uh, more V cards. All these V cards were 100% pulled from Dollar Tree packs, so... Um, you know, I've got that one there, and these ones here, and then, let's see, we have the gold Zamazenta pulled from a Dollar Tree pack. Now, Zamazenta's gold card is number, I want to say 217, 213, something like that. Uh, let's see. I'm going to break down and pull out the book because it's too hard to read the numbers on the bottom of the cards, so... Let's see. It is. This is my old book. As you can see, it's got all the checks in it. He is number 212. I was close, so 212. So, now, the Marnie is clearly not in my binder, but it is number 208. So, 212, 211, 210, 29, 28. So it would go right here, but as for now, it's going in the back of the binder. Now, as we continue this tour of my Pokemon uh, Sword and Shield collection, these are all Dollar Tree cards. All these energies are pulled from Dollar Tree cards. Uh, we've got every energy. Um, not so much in any specific order, but they kind of are. <laughs> and then these are promo cards. They're over here because they don't come from Dollar Tree packs, and the numbers on them don't really affect anything they're kind of just here for storage um, and then we've got the more Pico from the pin collection and more blank pages that we can add more stuff to it as time goes by uh, the rebel clash the, the rebel clash set has a hundred and ninety seven I think cards and uh, you know as I as I pull them they will get added to this binder whether they're um, whether they're from uh, Dollar Tree or not so uh, Anyhow, and then this is the back of the binder, so welcome to the back of the binder. We have this Snorlax card right here is the same one, so we do not need that. And then uh, this Rapidash, Galarian Rapidash, we only have um, the reverse hollow for it, so this one can go back here. And then we have regular Marnie right there so you can see that and then over here my binder's about to flip over over here we have the reverse hollow dreadnought that would be dex entry if uh but it's not sword and shield so the binder just fell and we have the rainbow rare Marnie and she is gonna go right up here in the corner and then we have the air balloon, which is going to go right here. I probably should put them in like numerical order, but I don't think I care enough for that. Kingler can go next to his water buddy, and more Pico V can go right up there. I thought about putting all my extra V and V Max cards in the back here until Rebel Clash came out. I was like, oh, you know what? I think I'm going to use it for that. But, anyways, guys, thank you for watching this binder update. Thank you for the 50 subscribers. Thank you everybody for watching. I hope everybody had a good Abra Community Day yesterday. And I do want to say thank you everybody for participating, for watching, for anything that you had to do with the Galler Friends Global Challenge. If you don't know what I'm talking about, go ahead and do a search on Galler Friend Global Challenge or you can watch the playlist that I've already created. You guys are going to love it. Thank you everybody. I love you all and I'll see you guys in the next one.